According to StatCounter.com, Google has a whopping 93% of search market share. But there's one search engine in particular that beats Google in privacy, speed, and accuracy. And the winner is Bing. Now wait, before you close this video and think I'm crazy, just hear me out. I used to be a loyal Google user too, until I discovered how much better Bing is and how it can improve your online experience. Just give me a few minutes and I'll help you see why you and your grandparents should all switch to Bing right now. Now the silver bullet that Bing has here is of course ChatGPT, which is the most advanced AI in the world. With ChatGPT, Bing understands the context and your intentions. So let me show you what I mean. We'll ask the same question to Google and Bing and see what happens. I am planning a trip for my 25th anniversary in September. What are some places we can go that are within a three hour flight from London Heathrow? So Google shows here several ads, but nothing specifically directed at my question. Bing, on the other hand, starts off with some anniversary trip ideas and destinations that are near London. And best of all, over on the right, you have a chat interface. It congratulates me on my anniversary and gives several options for that trip that are within three hours of London. And I can click the chat icon to dive in deeper. The context of my search is preserved as we roll up into the chat and I can ask some follow-up questions. So it's giving me some locations and I'll say, uh, Madrid sounds fun. Can you suggest a great hotel? And there it comes back with some answers right in the context of our conversation. Now, I think that the greatest example of this really shows up in the Linus Tech Tips WAN show. The guys over at LTT are no shills for Microsoft. In fact, they really do give them a hard time and rightly so. Windows search, I mean, come on, right? But let's watch a clip here from the WAN show and see what Linus and Luke think. It looked up the dimensions of the LTT backpack. It Shut looked up the up. dimensions of the trunk and it figured it out. How the f did it do that? A ask it, let's do it live because I thought the dimensions for the backpack are in picture form. Ser searching. Searching for that. Now it's searching up Shut LTD up. backpack dimensions. Shut up! This is a tricky question. Man, the natural like language of it. Have Look at this! shapes and dimensions. Based on some rough estimates, I will try to answer That's it. That's insane! What? That's actually nuts! It's, it's still going. It will depend on how flexible and compressible the backpacks are and how well they fit into the corners and curves of the trunk. Based on oh, some videos of the Model Y trunk. Shut up! It can fit about five to seven standard care and suitcases which have similar dimensions and capacity. Holy. Which is accurate. That's crazy. Because I had watched demos, I had watched tons of stuff. Up until that point, I didn't realize it was that capable. The various steps it had to go through. Yeah. Not only did it- It even showed its work. Yes, it searched the original question, realized there isn't really an answer for this out there yet. Decided I'm gonna look up the dimensions of the backpack. I'm gonna look up the dimensions of the trunk. I'm gonna realize that this trunk, even though I have dimensions and whatnot, is gonna have weird curves and stuff, which is gonna throw it off quite a bit. What can this backpack relate to? Oh, a standard size of luggage is extremely similar. Let's use that, because there's other references to how that can fit in this, th blah, 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 blah. This was full thought process, man. Okay. That's crazy. Okay. So I couldn't really have said it any better than they did. The power of ChatGPT is a natural language model combined with the ability to search the internet means that now Bing is the most powerful, fastest, and may be the very best search engine that you or your grandparents could use today. So start using it and see for yourself and give me some comments on what you think. While you're at it, subscribe to the Azure Academy and you can watch my next video over here because if you thought that was great, GPT-4 is gonna change everything again. And happy learning.